pizarra. This is one of the Spanish words I learned recently, and it means slate, blackboard, chalkboard, whiteboard, or in Cuba, a dashboard. It comes from the Basque word pizarra, which means fragment, blackboard, or slate. When I first saw this word, I thought it had something to do with pizzas, but obviously not, unless a blackboard is used as a menu in a pizza restaurant. Some related words and expressions include pizarra blanca, a whiteboard, pizarra de papel, a flip chart, pizarral, a slate quarry, pizarrin, a slate pencil, pizarron, a blackboard, and pizarroso, slaty soil or a slate roof. Another word for blackboard or chalkboard in Spanish, which is used in Spain, is encerado, which also means waxed, polished, wax-coloured oil cloth, tarpaulin, or tarp. It comes from encerar to wax or polish, from the Latin incerare to wax, from cera, wax, beeswax, honeycomb, wax tablet, wax seal, wax image which is also the root of the Spanish word cera, which means wax or crayon. Another word for a waxed writing tablet in Latin is tabula, and they have been used since at least the 14th century BC. The oldest known example was found in a shipwreck near the town of Kash in the southwest of Turkey. They usually consist of a wooden frame with wax in the middle, and often two such frames were joined together. A stylus was used to write in the wax, with a sharp end for writing and a flat end for erasing. They were used in parts of Europe until the 19th century. The Latin expression tabula rasa, meaning a blank or clean slate, literally an erased slate, originally referred to a tabula that has had the writing erased from it, and now refers to the idea that individuals are born without any innate mental content. They are blank slates. In some places where a slate is readily available, people used to write on it with chalk, especially in schools. They were also used to write people's debts in pubs and probably other places. Incidentally, the word pizza was borrowed from Neapolitan and is thought to be related to the Byzantine Greek word pita, a cake or pie. And when their debts had been paid, they had a clean slate or had had their slate wiped clean. Incidentally, the word pizza was borrowed from Neapolitan and is thought to be related to the Byzantine Greek word pita, meaning a cake or pie.